Away from politics, let's bring you utilities. Residents of Accra are urging the Ghana Water Company Limited to expand its capacity to address the escalating demand for water users. This concern arises from the Ghana Water Company Limited's acknowledgement of its inability to meet the growing population's water needs in the capital, Accra. City News' Fauzu Masawudi visited selected areas in Accra and reports that numerous residents are still grappling with the challenges of water shortage. At 3 p.m. in Awush, Abrantia, one of the many Zango settlements in Accra, inhabitants are visiting the mosque for answer prayers. However, due to erratic water supply, they have to perform ablution with water from deep sources or sachet water. Fatih Sumaila, Laments the cost of water for these rituals. Shani Ruana Damu Mukadam, Don Anna Muna on and off come Shani Ruagaski, she won't have made a chee damu. The Samuna name and Timaco, a kind Shani Rua, a duba, a Timacamuna. Eh, Gaskiani, don't you and Zaka Gama Salachi? Look and Gaka, Shani Ruanoni, Mbaka, Ruabaka, a Lola. Kachezaka is Sella. She said, No muke ni machina a tema kamuna kam butun rua. In your so musamu don't ruashi ne remutum. Ruashi che save chikum kumi, muna a dinchi muna yum kumi the shani rua non. The recurring water crisis in many parts of the country is impacting religious activities and causing discomfort for residents affecting domestic activities. Previously we've been getting water very well but of late about almost a week. Now, it has been like we've not been getting again, and we don't know, but we have some of them who have been getting in and out. So we thought it's uh, one or two problem around. So we don't know. We don't know. And you, uh, the Ghana Water Company has not communicated anything? Nobody has come and just talk about anything. And we're still giving the complaint to them, and we've not seen anything going on well with us. So how do you cope? Do you go elsewhere to fetch water? We fetch water around the neighborhood. We go to the other taps that are flowing, then we fetch water. So we're still waiting for, for them okay. to rectify the problem. Very well. So let's say on, on an average a day, how much do you spend on getting water elsewhere? Oh, they are fetching from the boreholes or, or tap somewhere? Um, I think the bucket of water, we know the amount that they use to collect. And we'll be fetching. I have uh, about uh, seven people in my mm -hmm. house. So just imagine when you use one, one, one times three per day, you, you just calculate and see. So, do we are not going to be kubu. We are kubu nidi. Until we know how much we are going to get, is it here? But all the same, we are kubu so we are going to get here. Say back to where is it now? You see where? I'm going to four cities. How about do we manage now? Who are do we have to get the babu and the betray? At our next stop in Namiche, we met Vicentia Zenichi, a food vendor, a miles away to fetch water from the only borehole serving the community. I have to take a long way to get water. It's been bad. It's been really disrupting our work because by the time you get to your workplace, you'll be even tired to even work. It's not easy. We are really suffering. We are really suffering. We need the government to help us because it's not helping at all. Look at me. Fetching this. Hey. It's not easy. Taking this big pan, and <laughs> it's not easy. But how long have you lived without you know, the water? It's almost about three weeks now. Children bear the brand too. Basic school student Sylvester Apia shares his continuous tardiness in school due to joining long queues to fetch water before leaving for school. At what time do you come here to fetch water? Like in the 4, four I want 4 a.m. 4 a.m. at dawn? Yeah. You come here to fetch water? Yeah. Doesn't it affect you? Yeah, it affects me plenty. Because when, when you come here, plain, like, plenty of people are here to fetch water. So, like, I, the time, the time is right. So, me, I can go to school, like, late. Like, me, maybe I'll go to school at 7 a.m. And they will ask me. For close to seven months, residents claim they haven't had a drop of water from their taps, severely impacting their livelihoods. They criticize authorities for bailing them despite erratic water supply. I'm saying so no, seven months in the young soon. It's all on the pan. It's a ball or yeah, bina. Yes, it's a so did you remember why saw when you been here? It's no one is why seven months. 
Then I'm back as a two, so yes, you need to be a yaka. It's an annual. The Ghana Water Company Limited, in an interview on City Breakfast Show, attributes the situation to a lack of capacity to meet the growing population of Accra, despite a volume increase to 150 million gallons. There was less supply because some we noticed after the this and that some of the water that gets into the treatment had reduced. And so the volume of water we're pushing into the system also reduced automatically. And are you saying this morning that that challenge has been resolved? The challenge has been resolved. So now we are move, pushing the water and it's getting to the places. So within the shortest possible time, people should... So by wh- for those who have not had water for three months, by when should they expect that their water will start flowing regularly? So by this weekend, if they are not getting it, they have to go to the regional offices and district offices. And you see, if you, we, our numbers are all over. And so when you go to the district and you are not getting attention, escalate it to the region. The regional chief managers yeah. had working ready to Fair enough. support. Residents argue that it is the company's mandate to meet citizens' demand regardless of the population and charge them to promptly restore water supply to normalcy. They, they are doing their job and the population is also growing and they should know better. They should know better. The Ghana Water Company says it is working tirelessly to meet the growing demand of water consumers in Accra. But until that happens, residents will still have to grapple with the issue of erratic water supply. For City News, Fauzu Masaudu, Accra.